So this Friday, November 17th, Prescott Fire Department is going to host the 64th annual Light Up the Night Christmas Parade mm-hmm. starting at 7 o'clock from South Granville District High School. And we're hoping for uh, another fantastic event. you have any estimate on how many people come out to this every year? We estimate probably between eight and 10,000 visitors. Wow. Which is pretty, pretty unique considering the population of, of Prescott. Yeah. yeah, that's more than Prescott's population. <laughs> it is almost double. <laughs> and, and really, it just, just goes from Edward down to King and then, and then up the street. And, and it, it's just all these people in a, in a small area. Yeah, that's amazing how many people jam in. Yeah. You're right. It goes down Edward. And then uh, west on King up to about St. Lawrence Street. But it's uh, some of the spots we can barely get some of the big trucks and floats through. There's so many kids and and spectators. Now, what else is happening along the route that we should know about Friday? So we have some things happening. Uh, the Legion has their annual spaghetti dinner prior to the parade. Okay. Um, there's some Christmas caroling down by the, the clock tower. This year, coinciding with Canada 150 theme, the Prescott Fire Department is having our parade marshals. Uh, they're going to include past fire department members. Mm-hmm. We'll have two floats that will be uh, dedicated to our past members. We have Mackenzie Green. She's going to be our youth ambassador. And there's lots of other great things going on. Uh, Tim Hortons is selling the... Smile Cookies, with all the proceeds going towards Light Up the Night. Okay. So Granville District High School will be doing their annual Spirit of Giving food drive throughout the route. And we'll be kicking off the Christmas season in a great way. Um, now, if you want to be in the parade, did you just show up, or do you have to pre-register for that? Nope. You can just show up. We'd like you to be at the high school between 6 and 6.15 okay. to kind of line up and get ready. There's no cost, no pre-registration. We just ask if we get more lights and Christmas music, lots of smiles and some candy for the kids. That's all you need to have. All right. We can't wait for this Friday, the 64th, the first Christmas parade of 2017. Can't wait. It's going to be a great time. You got her. Thank you.